what is going on guys well today I just wanted to update you guys because the PlayStation Store just got an update with a bunch of new themes for the PlayStation 4 so I wanted to go ahead and log on check those out with you guys um, it should be easier to get to the dynamic the themes um, themselves on the PlayStation 4 you should be able to go into extras let's see we're seeing the 20th anniversary PlayStation 4 theme that one's epic that one's awesome I freaking love that one so much there we go yay themes is good as only category now we don't have to go searching for them like crazy <laughs> I'm happy about that so most of these themes are actually third-party um, themes and that's why you're seeing a, a hefty price tag <laughs> I say hefty but that's how much they cost when it was Ooh, this looks pretty cool that's how much they cost when they were on the PlayStation 3 and um, they are created um, uh, th third party so it's not um, most of these are not created by Sony um, but Sony allows them to upload it oh look the aquarium dynamic theme this was a uh, this is a classic on the PlayStation uh, PlayStation 3 this one definitely is a classic do, do we get fishies flying? Oh, we get fishies in the background. It'd be cool if fishies were flying like on top of the apps and stuff. Kind of like how the um, the X's, squares, and uh, circles fly around. I think that would be pretty cool. Some of these are um, pretty awesome. Um, gotta admit, I don't know how I feel about this one. I mean, it's cool that it looks like the Matrix. But that back... Let's see if we can get a closer look. Yeah. The... The screenshot of the background I don't know just maybe it once it's downloaded it looks cool but just the screenshot the still of it kind of looks a little bit blurry then again you probably are gonna need to um, download it to see but I, I don't know if I'm gonna waste 350 on that <laughs> um, a lot of these are freaking awesome um, again but is it worth purchasing for three dollars um, a lot of the PlayStation 1 games were for sale for 250 in the last sale that they had so um, I would have probably uh, rather pick up one of those classic games than just a theme um, especially with this bad boy here the 20th anniversary theme my favorite by far I definitely would recommend it if you guys haven't downloaded it already um, I've downloaded the this one and then destiny destiny was actually um, the one that I had as a theme before the 20th anniversary rolled out um, and then I also had this one um, before that uh, again all the free ones I always download and um, that way even if I don't use them they're always there in case I ever want to use them later on in the future because once you hit that download button they're always going to be in your download queue but the PlayStation Store doesn't always keep them there so just keep that in mind as well anyways guys I hope you appreciate um, me doing this really quick I just wanted to go over it because I was pretty excited that they finally added more dynamic themes to the PlayStation 4 we've been waiting for them I know a lot of us have there's some uh, new free ones in there and then there's a, a lot more that you would have to actually purchase um, so if you guys like this Make sure to hit that like, that really helps me out. Also, if you haven't already, please subscribe because I stay up to date on all of the latest PlayStation 4, PlayStation Plus news, updates, all that good stuff so you guys don't have to. So you can find out when new themes come out or um, when a new game gets released or a beta, what have you. Anyways, guys, I have also partnered with crunchyroll.com um, if you guys are interested in anime at all I would definitely recommend for you to go and check it out I've got a 14 day free trial waiting for you guys crunchyroll.com forward slash monkey flop the link will be in the description it's pretty cool I've had it for about a month or so I haven't had too much time to actually sit down and watch a bunch of the anime that's on there but let's say uh, 
you guys want to give it a try you guys can go ahead and give it a try for 14 days if you don't like it at all you can cancel it or you can keep the subscription and watch unlimited anime for uh, less than seven dollars a month um, I thought that was pretty cool and usually I don't mention um, a lot of the affiliates that I've ha that I have and I have a lot of people approaching me and I want to be really careful and really specific on who I choose to partner up with and crunchyroll.com uh, was actually offered a pretty good deal for you guys and I wanted to go ahead and give that offer to you as well um, either way thanks for watching this video you guys are awesome as always and I will see you guys in the next news update